Mom and Bebo are the same age. But still, Mom is taller than Bebo is. So now let's take it a bit higher in age. It might be Andrews or or Uncle Jimmy. What do you think? Oh, an age? Yeah, I think you're right. I think that they're the same age. I think Aunt Jules and Uncle Jimmy are the same age. Yeah. I'm not sure, but, but I think so. But still. But still. Even if they are like something and uh, still close to, to, to like... 40, 40 or 50 years old? No, no, no. They're 31. 32. Wait, all right. 33. 33. All right. So now let's take age higher than all of them. You. You're 61 years old. No, not like yet. 60. 60. I'll be 61 in January. All right. Don't rush it. You're one of the, you're the second oldest in our family. Let's take up to the world record of all of us. Oh, it's, it was the same person that was the, also the tallest. Don't go, no, Papa Joey. He, he is 33, no, 63 years old. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. All right, but now I have one more thing to explain of science, science about our family. Let's. I'll think about that. Hmm. Aha! Who is the cutest in our family? The cutest? Aha, uh -huh, like, like something from a human to a dog. Oh. Like, like, large, like, large as a human and small as a dog. Because we already know our dogs are much, are still smaller than I am. That's true. So... Let's start with one one of the one of the not cute ones. It's let's let's say that those that those two ones, the not cutest ones, it's Uncle Jimmy and Papa Joey, right? They're not cute. Well, I can only say one thing about them to to help you explain about them. Okay. The very large much larger than my mom is. That's true. And they're, and they're both the world records of our family. So if, if so you're saying if you're really tall then you can't be cute? Well, like Papa let me tell you something about Papa Joey. Really. Papa Joey's no joke. He's a lot scarier than my mom is. Oh, you think he's scary? Well so, example, Papa Joey might be the scariest, I guess. And he's the biggest, too. Yeah. So, now let's go a bit shorter. Now let's go a bit cuter. Hmm, let me think. A cute would be a, a bit a cuter. Hmm. What does cute mean? Like something so beautiful. Oh. Hmm. I'm going to... Think about about what what would be next of cutest. That's a tough one. Hmm. Let's say let's do this with one of the tallest, but not but not on but not Uncle Jelly and Papa Joa. Let's go with Hoy. Okay. Next. Okay. Jorge is one of the tallest of of parents instead of just like grandparents. Right, that's right. So he's the only one. He's the only parent that's the that's the tall that's the tallest and the most oldest in the parents' family. Oh yeah. But still, even your even your grandparents, you're still gonna be cuter. Oh, thank you. So, next, let's go a bit smaller than that. Hmm, let me see. Ma, 
mom. Oh, yeah. She's really cute. Yeah. She's like, like, I don't know, like twice the size of me or very close to twice the size of me. Yeah. So, anyway, let's go with cuter sizes. Babo. When Babo used to, when I, when I and Babo used to have a fight, oh, mom always gets on to us. Oh, she does? Mm-hmm. That's why I put her her icon like this. Look. Look. Oh. I'm going to change something. Yeah. Okay. To make it look cuter. Okay. All right. So, icon. It's a damn minute. It's got a lot of... Oh, there we go. Alright. You may look at the new icon. Oh, I see. It's changing that mom's a thing to a beautiful one. Oh, oh, she is beautiful. And done. Good job. There we go. So now let's go cuter than than Babo is. Let's okay. see. Oh, it's you. Oh, <gasps> thank you. Cause you're, cause you're one of the shortest of the fam, of the, of the, of the family. Even though you're, you're very old. Yeah, you That's can still be cute even if you're very old. Yeah, cause sometimes <laughs> if you're a grandparent, you can be very big or short. Short. Oh yeah, am I big or short? Mm -hmm. Well, I, I would say I would say more votes on short. Oh, okay. you're not that big at all. That's true. So now let's go cuter <laughs> than you. Okay. Aunt Jules. Oh yeah, she's cute. Aunt Jules is one is is the same age as Uncle Jimmy, but much smaller. Oh yeah, she's like half as tall as him. Oh yeah. <laughs> now let's go a bit cuter. The youngest of them all in humans. Can you guess who's that? Hmm, I think it's a very handsome, cute little boy well, named... Well, you can guess that one easy. Michael James Pena! Pena. Yes! <laughs> I was the only human that's the, the youngest of them all. Yeah. I was one of the cutest ones ever, but I don't know much about life than, than games. Oh, yeah. Well, you kids don't you're... understand a lot, but 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 when you grow up, you're you understand. Now let's go to next in humans. Okay. The one will not exist until I'm a <gasps> the new baby. Oh my goodness! New babies are some. It takes the start of a baby takes when you're grown up. It takes a baby for for like a year for it. For it to start out, no nine nine months. Oh, that's right. Yes. So so maybe start out nine months, all the way down to seconds until your baby comes out. Oh, true. Yep. All right. And and finally, we're gonna reach the number, the number, the number. Four dogs that are the cutest in our family. Wait, I forgot. I forgot the two, the two smallest dogs in my family. Cause I'm their dad, but not like, but I'm their. I'm actually their. You may not know it, but I'm not talking about your dogs. Oh. That would be their, their, your great. They're great. Their grandpa. Oh yeah. So, Rosie and Hanky are my little kids, right? Oh. So. 
Well, they're kind of like your brother and sister, sort of, because they're your mom and dad's dogs. Oh, uh, yeah. So now let's go to the babies of the mall. We'll, we'll start from the biggest to the smallest. Hang on, I'm, I'm going to stop this video here and then we'll start a new one for that one.